Hello, today I'm going to help you make a safe city, always a safe city, and you never be without one, as long as you play the game. In this game, this is a war game, this is not a happy-go-lucky thing like Farmville or Candy Crush. You will be attacked, you will be attacking others. And if you are attacked, they will take your stuff, whether you like it or not. If you don't like it, oh well, there's Candy Crush to play. But you can protect your city so that you do not get all your uh, stuff taken, like your food and your wood and your stone and your ore, your A stone, your gold. Would you like to keep it all the time and have nobody steal it? I'm here to show you how. I have already built all my cities and went into to uh, ascend them. I already ascended them out. And like this one here, right up here, these little boxes. The one, If you have a gray one, that's a good thing because uh, you're under protection. This one here, I'm under protection for one day, two hours, 31 minutes. It starts out when you... Ascend to your city, it starts out you have three days for protection. And during that three days, that particular city holds all your supplies. Every one of them. All of them. And when you're under protection like this, people cannot steal. They cannot scout. They can't do anything. So you're lucky. Now, <clears throat> as you see here, Move this down here. I don't care if this is in the red. Who cares? It never goes below 240 million, billion. Over here shows my wood, my stone, my ore, and my stone. A stone, I call it. Because everybody pronounces it different. Is it ether stone? Is it ether stone? It's a stone to this boy. So I'd be calling it a stone from here on out. All right. It always stays that way. If I look over here, my second city, look, it's all pretty low, isn't it? See that? So if I get raided, they're going to get squat. They're going to go home and go, wow, why? Because everything's over here. Okay? And while I'm over here just for the heck of it, What's the most important thing in this world right now? No, it's not gold. It's ore. If you're not making as much ore as you can, baby, you will be asking others for it. All right, let's get into this, okay? Well, how do you make a safe city like this? Well, what you do is you go up here to PowerBot. If you have PowerBot, click on it. Go to Transport. If you're on Overbill, View, oh, what the heck? Go to Transport. And I have mine all set up already, but how do you do it, right? So I'm just going to make up one, right? I'm going to make a new route. And, oh, it's back up here. In case you, you forgot, okay, your protected city for, let's say, right now is your seventh city. So you go to PowerBot. See how it's already on your seventh city lit green? And so we're going to, let's say, cancel that again. I'll show you. Make a new route, okay? Seven. But it's already my protected city. So I want to move from my number one to number seven. From number one to number seven. What are you going to use? Well, I hope you got lots of supply wagons, because let me tell you, if not, you're going to wish you did. So you pick one. Me, it's supply wagons. And I'm going to stick in here my items, how much I want to send across. So you got to put your little checkbox here, because when it's gray, sorry, you can't put a number in there. And you pop that in here like that. Okay, and I'm just going to stick some crap in here. You know, come down here and it's boring or what. And uh, that's a little bit there. I'm going to make 
keep them right anyway. <laughs> and if you don't like typing, check this out. You can blue it, copy, come down here, blue it, paste. Now on this, usually on the stone, a stone, I usually put it 100,000. And the gold, I usually put it one and one, two, three, one, two, three. All right. Now, uh, right up here, see this right there? I put mine at 96 and I put a check on it. Why? Because reverse transport means that if one city drops below what you're supposed to keep, more than. 96%, that city, like number seven, will send wagons over to number one and replenish you. See, isn't that cool? So if you're gone and you're running out of ore, like you always do, guess what? This city will send this city some ore when you drop below this number, whatever you put in. When you are done, oh, back over. Wait, 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 wait. I put check roots every minute, march every two seconds. Most important, you only got food or, or you know what, food is not important anymore, guys. Sorry, your troops won't die. They changed that. Make it ore because you want that to be your top priority because the big guys out there that want your stuff, the most important thing they're going to take is your ore. So now you hit save route. Okay, and you do that with all your cities. You just go back through, and you go to number two, and look, it stays. All the, the numbers you put in stay, hit save root. Go up to number three, it stays, save root. Number four, save root. It's that simple. Okay, all right. Keep an eye on this puppy right here. When that gets down to 12 hours or more, depending on your work schedule, uh, your sleep time, whatever. But anyway, make sure you have at least 12 hours to do nothing but build another city. So what you do then is you go down to the other city here, you hit ascend, you pick one out, and then you start all over, and you start ascending. That now is your safe city, this one. On me, let's say it's this right now, see? But if I make this one, if I send this one, this one also will have this next to it. And it will tell you two days, whatever hours, all right? Bang, start pounding that out. You take all your wagons to send over here. Okay, they will. Because what you're then going to do is you have to go to your power bot, go back here, and oh, cancel. Okay, there they all are. All the ones you had, right? You go to edit, and you change. This is going to go to here. No, we want it here. And then you hit save root. And you go back through, I'm going to hit cancel because I don't want to do that. And you do the next one, hit that, hit save route. But I'm going to hit cancel. You get the picture, you get it. If you have any questions, just, you know, send me a message to the messenger. Don't try the chat thing. Um, all right, let's say now you have sended all your cities, okay, to the max. To the absolute max. Okay? You have gone all the way to level 10. Now what do you do? Well, this one's a little ballsy. Okay? You go to your city. It's going to go to here. You go over to the castle. You hit castle, and guess what you're going to do? Boom. Abandoned city. I know. I know. <laughs> You're going to curl your toes and go crazy, but abandon that city, see, and start it out from scratch, like when you first started the game. Guess what? You're under protection. Now you send all your crap over there. 
and you keep doing it over and over and over. Ah, oh, it's it's that simple. Okay, so I hope you understand. I hope you get it. If not, um, this is my first run on doing the video today. I, this is my take one. So, if you have any questions? Go down below. I will have my email address. The email address. Send me an email and put in the subject KOC. If you don't put KOC, I might delete your butt. All right. So anyway, get out there, kick ass, and all that. And maybe I'll think of something else up here to kind of throw at you, uh, like barbs and all this, or whatever. You have any questions? Want a video on it? I'll try my best. Hey, we're out.